So this is possibly the greatest texture pack you're ever going to find in Terraria. With the help of my Discord, I have made every single boss from Terraria into Among Us imposters. So we're going to be going through every single boss and I'm going to be showcasing all the wonderful work we have done. As soon as this texture pack comes out on Steam, I'll be sure to drop it in the description down below. But without further ado, let's start off with King Slime. So if you guys thought I was joking, take a look at this. King Slime, isn't this absolutely beautiful? And I promise you, it's every single boss. Every single boss in the game has an Among Us look to it. Let's finish off this King Slime. Look at him. This is absolutely foul. Who made this? Who made this? I wonder who. I'll get the Zenith on him. King Slime defeated. All right, so I have Cthulhu looking kind of sus. Let's check out what the second form is like. We have a normal imposter. Let's see what happens once the mouth opens up. That is absolutely terrifying. I'm sorry you guys have to bear witness to this. Let's finish off the I have Cthulhu. Oh my goodness. I'm actually scared. I am genuinely scared right now. All right, so next up we have the Eater of Crewmates or the Eater of Worlds. Whatever you want it to go by is what it's going to go by. But look at this thing. This looks horrendous. Oh my goodness. This has to be my favorite texture pack I've ever covered, I've ever downloaded, I've ever seen. Let's finish off this Eater of Crewmates, Eater of Worlds. There's still a little bit of him left. Where is he? There we go. Finish him off. What do you guys think about that one? Personally, I like it a lot. But trust me, there are better ones. There truly are better ones. For example, like our next boss, which is the Brain of Cthulhu. Look at this. There's an imposter as the brain. It's looking beautiful as ever. Let's see what its second form is like. There's there's an imposter inside. This is exactly what you want your friends to not know that you have activated on their PC. Like you guys need to download this once it comes out on your friends' computers and while they're fighting a boss, just have them be completely oblivious to this. Trust me, it would be hilarious. The next boss we're going for is going to be Skeletron. Let's get rid of his hands first. Look at him. What happens when Skeletron starts spinning? Just let's just watch. Look at how look at how hilariously stupid that looks. Oop, the guy's dealing some damage to him. Let's finish off Skeletron. Let's get this poor man out of here. We need to stop torturing him. We're using the Amazon right now, and Skeletron should be down in absolutely no time. There we go. Beautiful. Look, we got Chippy's couch. Respect the Chippy. Sit down. Boom. Next up, we got the Sus B. How are we gonna do against this? Let's see what this one looks like. Look at her. Isn't that absolutely beautiful? Queen B. You probably my least favorite boss one of my least favorite bosses in terraria i find this boss so filler but look at her among us queen bee this is absolutely phenomenal this is the only reason i like the boss now just because of this texture pack if it wasn't for this texture pack i would not be fighting this boss right now come on let's deal some damage finish it off there we go queen bee defeated all right wall of flesh i have come to challenge you the wall of sus wall of imposters look at this this is an absolute joke oh my god look at the eyes look at the mouth you guys need to try this texture pack out once it gets released trust me you will not be disappointed even the hungry even the wall of flesh's own minions look like characters from among us let's finish this off a little bit faster spam the knight's edge a little bit look at its health going down pretty quickly whip out the stellar tune decimate its health lunar flare Shoot it once, shoot it twice, shoot it three times, and the wall of flesh is dead. Now that we are in hard mode, let's fight our very first hard mode boss. Can you guess what it's gonna be? Well, if you guessed Queen Slime, then you are 100% correct. This one, for some reason, was bugged out a little bit. We couldn't get it red, but we got the textures down, so at least that works. Get some Zenith on her, because I do not like this boss. I want to get over this boss as fast as I can. Drop a comment below, tell me if you like the Queen Slime. Personally, I hate this boss. It's my least favorite boss. It feels very very filler but i want to hear your opinions shoot the razor pine at her look at her health she's super close to dying i'm gonna whip out the stellar tune finish her off with this queen slime at least you're more tough than the king slime but still i do not want to see you anytime soon but getting into the more proper hard mode bosses we have the destroyer of crewmates that's what I'm gonna call him. You can give him a name if you want. Give me some creative name suggestions in the comments. But right, look at this. We have the little probes stuck in their cages. Let's deal some damage to him. Oh, we killed him by accident. The destroyer has been defeated. I didn't mean to finish him off that quick. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's not my fault that the destroyer is such a weak boss. Hopefully the twins aren't gonna be as weak as the destroyer was, but look at this. You think this is bad? Let me show you what happens once they actually transform. So let's get one of them to transform. Look at this. 
it's all right. That whole texture has been completed too, okay? Let's finish off one of the twins and I want to show you the other one as well. So there we go, we have one dead. Now look at this one's texture once it transforms as well. Isn't that phenomenal? Oh my lord. Once again, this is the greatest Terraria texture pack to ever live. I dare you to argue with me. Nothing comes close to this. And to finish off the hard mode mechanical bosses, we have Skeletron Prime. How does this man compare against us? Let's take out his hands. Of course, let's use the Zenith. Make this process much faster. Drop his last hand as well. And look at him. Now you're just weak old Skeletron. You don't even have your hands anymore. What happened? You were so strong. You can see his eyes glowing from the inside. Look at his spikes. Aren't the spikes beautiful as well? Finish off Skeletron Prime. Let's move on to Plantera. All right, Plantera, Plantera. This is one of the prettiest textures on our list. Look at her. Absolutely phenomenal. All the vines are well made. All of her hooks are well made. Props to me. I was the one that made this. I didn't make her main texture, but I did make her attacking texture that you will see next. Once she becomes angry, you'll see the part that I made because I didn't make this main one. Let's get her angry. Let's get her to half health. You see this texture right here? I made this. I, Boyo Boyo himself, made this Plantera texture. Isn't it beautiful? What do you guys think? Rate it on a scale from 1 to 10. I want to know what you guys think about this texture. Let's finish her off. And Plantera is gone. Golem, Golem. I also made Golem, guys. What do you guys think? I retextured Golem. By retexture, I mean more or less I just colored him in and added his little visors. But yeah, tell me what you think. Should I be a full-time texture pack developer? Wouldn't that be great, huh? Boyo Boyo makes your Terraria texture packs. Relogic hired me to make sprites. Golem is looking fantastic. Let's finish him off with this. Stellar Tune. Get some Zenith on him. Get him out of here. We do not like Golem. Too easy of a boss for me. Lunatic Cultist. Look at you. You think you're all tough, huh? Let's see how you stand against the Zenith. I don't care if you're from Among Us. You still can't take on the Terraria Zenith. Poor Cultist. Look at him. He's bearing witness to the horrors. Unfair. Unfair advantage that we have going on here. Does he really think this is going to help him? Get rid of him right now. One thing you probably didn't know is that I also did the pillars as well. Me and my Discord ended up finishing the pillars too. So let's check out this pillar right here. Nebula pillar. We have an Among Us version of this. Stardust pillar. There's an Among Us version of this as well. Vortex pillar looking phenomenal as always and the solar pillar the imposter pillar itself looking better than ever But do you guys know what comes after the pillars? I hope you do because after the pillars we have the sus lord himself the moon lord Now don't write me in the comments saying oh my god boy. Oh, you forgot the empress of light What about duke fish on we'll get to them. We'll get to them They're probably even better than moon lord see moon lord's a little bit buggy It was very hard to find a lot of his textures. I tried my best, but he looks horrific Let's finish him off as fast as we can so we can get to the Empress of Light and Duke Fish Run because those ones are probably my favorite. Not gonna lie, they're probably my favorite. If we die to Moon Lord, are you serious? We have full solar armor. There's no way. There we go. Okay, I was actually scared for a second that we might die to the Moon Lord with solar armor and a Zenit. I would have been very sad. I would have probably cried. Pick up the Moon Lord gear. I'm gonna delete it. It's not like I need it anyways. But let me show you the Empress of Light. Tell me this boss isn't beautiful even in the Among Us version, okay? Absolutely beautiful boss fight. We kept the rainbow wings. I feel like there was no need to actually take them away because why would you want to get rid of the rainbow it's absolutely awesome her attacks are still as phenomenal as always well, let's finish her off and move on to duke fishron so right the last boss we have one of my favorites on here is duke fishron he looks absolutely wonderful with this texture pack you have to admit this is beautiful this is the way duke fishron should always look you can't argue with me here look at his health right now he's super low we're gonna take him out without a doubt finish him off here real quick and there we go duke fishron has been defeated wasn't that a beautiful set of bosses what do you think? If you want to see more videos, check out these ones over here. Consider subscribing to the channel. If you want to see more custom texture packs, get this video to 500 likes. I'll be sure to drop another one very soon. Once again, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I'll see you next time. Peace out.